Hi everyone. So I know what I'm going to be doing in the next phase of my life. Which could be my last phase for all I know, who knows. But the next phase of my life, I have this one clear goal. To be who I am, the real me, in this world, in this world system, among people. That is my only goal. And that is an extremely tough goal because, like, let's look at this point. Who here in this world is real in the world? Who's here is real in any job or any position or any responsibility? Because what I see is we put on all this fakeness and that's really the problem. And you look at children, how they're brought up, they're brought up in the same way. And if we make that shift of each of us standing up and simply being real in the world, being our real selves in the world every day, daily, that would have a tremendous impact in today and the future to come for the future humanity. And so I would see it as an absolute success, success if I actually live this. If I hold any job, any position in the world where I'm interactive with people, I'm among people, and I'm being real, and I'm being myself, that to me would be the same thing as climbing Mount Everest five times. And that would be, for me, an absolute great achievement. Because what I see in this world is compromise. I see people who are not real within their jobs, within who they are, in everyday life among people. And that's what I see. And when I look for people who are being real in the world, I don't see it. So, this would be a tremendous achievement for life. This would be a victory for life, for me to do this. And for me, yes, it's almost like facing discrimination in a way. Because, in general, people are not supportive of this. They're not welcoming of this. They are resistant to this. They are reacting to this they react to what is real and so yeah it's going to be a tremendous challenge it's going to be like like climbing Mount Everest five times that's what I'm going to face and that and there are people who face that kind of hardship before in their lives and they have succeeded but because they stuck to it no matter what until the end and they found some sort of success that for another person would have been, let's say, easy. But for me in this situation, it's like the sacrifice. Are you sacrificing your real self? And it's not about self-interest or being selfish. It's about me being real for everyone, for the future of humanity, for the future of people. I mean, how can we have a, a better future if we are not real in our everyday lives? How can it come about? So I see that making that shift, making that commitment, having this achievement is something I can do and is something that will have a tremendous impact on the future for everyone. And it's something I can do. I can do it. I have the strength, I have the power. This is what I've been working towards the last seven years. So all I have to do is do it. And, yeah, I, I'm placing myself in a position I know what I'm getting myself into. But I know also the reward. I know the outcome. I know the potential that this can have for, for everyone, for future generations into infinity. So I say, considering that, it's definitely worth it. 
and I am again <laughs> achieving the impossible. So this is me. I'm being real. I know I'm a wonderful person. I have so many great qualities and I create so much in this world and I'm just going to continue doing that. So thank you very much. Bye.